Atkins Diet for Diabetes As licensed naturopathic physician, Kathy Wong, said there is no weight loss program that is entirely perfect for everyone. However, applying the Atkins Diet for Diabetes, especially those that have been diagnosed as type 2, is best suited for them. First of all, before following the Atkins Diet for Diabetes, there is a need for you to know if you have a blood sugar problem. Here is a checklist, feeling hungry in between meals, craving for sweets or starchy foods, thirsty all the time, urinating frequently, getting up in the morning with a headache, irritable and hungry, constantly exhausted, sleepy in the daytime, difficulty in concentrating, want to doze off after eating, there are also warning signs of this disease which includes extreme hunger or thirst, unexplained weight loss, blurry vision, hand or feet numbness, slow healing of wounds and bladder infections. For the condition not to get worse, the individual should not restrict the intake of refined sugar in some grains. Atkins Diet for Diabetes has meal plans at three different levels of carbohydrate consumption. It begins at 20 grams each day which builds up to 40 and 60 grams on the following. There are also several recommendations such as, no limits on fat and protein, low fat dairy products are not advised, no more than 4 ounces of cheese each day. The benefit of the Atkins diet for diabetes is that it has been helping people to restrain carbohydrates which is the key to prevent and manage the sickness. It has supported those who are overweight that are addicted to dulcet munchies to decrease their risk factors. However, it has evolved into a controversy where many medical experts have questioned such theory due to the danger it brings. In the latest series of the Dr. Robert Atkins book, he included dishes that only require 15 to 20 minutes of preparation. It consists of salmon and papillote with tomato basil relish, grilled chicken and avocado salad with sweet mustard vinaigrette and Mexican chicken soup pork tenderloin with sweet and sour red cabbage. What a heavy and healthy meal. As mentioned earlier, there have been many critics of the Atkins diet for diabetes and here are what they have to say. It advocates on eating too much amounts of protein and fat when in fact, it eliminates a lot of water weight in the body. It can strain the kidneys and liver that creates ketones. Even if ketones suppress the appetite, it causes dizziness, bad breath and gas. It also contributes to damages in the heart and kidney. It identifies all carbohydrates as bad including vegetable when it actually promotes essential vitamins and minerals. It depletes glycogen stores which is a form of carbohydrates stored in the liver and muscle that is a primary fuel source for exercise. For more free educational content, visit learnforfree.biz. Content produced and distributed by AllSuperInfo.